the last few weeks, I've been the target of rumors, ridicule, mockery, and pranks. So if I'm going to be crucified for being someone I'm not, I might as well be honest about who I am. I'm not writing this to clear my name or to point the finger at anyone else. I broke up with someone I couldn't love because I realized something about myself. I'm gay. No one deserves to be treated like this. Do better, Crown Lake. proud of you. Can we throw you a coming out party? Get you some rainbow swag? <laughs> and you can tell me anything. I hope you know that. Thank you. Your article was awesome, Ari. Thanks. It's cool that you're gay. Now I get why you were into me. I'm straight and I'm not into you. Oh, huh. it's weird. Once again, I'm learning something deeply personal and important about my sister on the internet. Just give her some time. Will you do me a favor? Molly has a disciplinary hearing later. Will you try to talk to Electra? I'll try my best, but you know her. <gasps> Ari's article is blowing up. The White Rabbit is not built for this much traffic. It's that popular? Literally everyone is reading it. <sighs> I need some air. Well, um, are you okay? And that's about time. Finish up your final sentences and pass in your tests. So? So I think I aced it. Mine is question four. I didn't ace that. No, not about the test. By your hearing, today, right? Today, indeed. Hey, sorry, but there's something I have to do. Where is everyone? Ari skipped too? Does this antenna not matter to anyone else but me? Would it kill you to be a little more supportive? If she cared how I felt, then she would have told me in person. Lex, she probably wanted to. I can't have this conversation right now. How are we doing with flyers? I have to go prepare for the hearing and nobody's here. Listen, Lex, I got the flyers covered. Don't worry. Just go easy on Molly, okay? Why? Because she's right. And Ari's right too. This place is stuck in the past. Crown Lake shouldn't be on the wrong side of history. History is exactly why it's important. It's what makes the school special. Hey. If you're here to apologize, it's fine. I'm over it. Apologize? How could you do that? Do what? The article? People are going to put it together and I'm not ready to talk about this with strangers. I can sympathize with that, Lisa, but what I don't understand is why you would bully me. You weren't listening to me. Someone's been blackmailing me all semester. She has footage of me throwing Molly's uniform outside the night it got burnt up. That was you? No, but she's making it seem like it, and she's making me do all kinds of terrible things. I kept getting in deeper and deeper. Well, the truth's out now. Might as well tell Felicity we know it was her. It's not Felicity, Ari. It's Heather. She has proof, pictures, and I would be kicked out of here in a second. My parents don't have money like yours. Is that what you want, me to leave forever? Of course it's not what I want, Lisa, but what do you expect me to do? Keep all of this bottled up? I got a message from Heather this morning. She says she will stop, but that's only if Molly backs off of her investigation. Join me, come on. Hi guys, we're protesting the dress code. Hey, got time to protest the dress code, right? We're protesting the dress code. Join me, come on, let's protest the dress code, right? Hey, we're protesting the dress code. I don't know if you knew that, but we're protesting the dress code, okay.
Morgan, I need your help. I'm a little busy right now. This can't wait. I have news, big news, and I need you to post it on the White Rabbit. What's your scoop? The fire in the 90s. It was actually an elaborate frame-up perpetrated against Nellie Chambers through secret underground passages. I think the arsonist was Headmistress Baker herself. <laughs> wow. I like it. I need to post on White Rabbit, but every time I click post, it says error. Welcome to my life. Someone hacked the app a few days ago, and I haven't been able to take it back. Here, send it to me, and I'll try and upload it. Got it. Here goes nothing. The whole site just crashed. What? How? Can we get it back? I can do one better. Whoever's on the other side of this just made a big mistake. Now that the site's offline, I can put it on a local server and get control of the site back. Two things, Molly. First, I don't like working with someone looking over my shoulder. Also, your disciplinary hearing started 10 minutes ago. TikTok. Not a great start, Miss King. So sorry. Electra, can we get started? The student bylaw states that students must wear uniforms during all official school activities unless otherwise specified by school administration. Failure to comply will result in disciplinary hearing. Molly, you now have the opportunity to make your case. Wait, I have to speak? Thank you for joining the protest. Here are your skirts. All right, let me give you a pair of pants. All right, thank you so much. Oh, thank you for joining the protest. Here, take your pants. You can go up and change. Here, let me give you a blazer. All right, thank you so much for joining the protest. The dress code is very vague and dated and, and honestly, pretty discriminatory. And I know that we can accessorize and wear. gave me a verbal warning, but they're going to review the uniform policy. Crown Lake is finally entering the 21st century. That's great, Molly, but listen, we really need to talk. Thanks. I think your article had a lot to do with it. Everyone loves it. Not everyone. We need to talk. Molly. I got the white rabbit back up. And when I did, this popped up. It's a riddle. Like someone's posting from the basement. Danny. Do you know where your dad is right now? Excuse me? Are you really accusing my dad of doing this? Wait, Danny, that's not no, what- wait, Molly, there's something else. The post came from your phone. My phone, it's gone. <sighs> hey, there you are. You said you wanted to talk. Um, have you seen my phone? Someone's going after Lisa and I because of you. What are you talking about? Whoever it is, they're making Lisa do all of these terrible things because of you. Because you kept breaking the rules and pushing the limits. You're the reason Heather is back. You need to stop. We are so close, we can't stop now. You mean you can't stop, even if it means I'm the one getting hurt. Check her backpack. It's right over there. Wait, what's going on? Following up on a tip. What? Why? What's going on? Molly, someone said you cheated on your exam. You can't just go through my stuff. I say this counts. This is the answer key for your midterm, right, Sophia? No, I didn't. What do you- We have a zero tolerance policy for cheating at Crown Lake. This is an automatic suspension with a review for expulsion. Until that time, you are under house arrest. Not allowed to leave the room.
next time on Crown Lake. You need to stop obsessing. You're going crazy. There's too much at stake. The keypad obviously goes to the old boiler room. If you disappear tonight, you'll definitely get kicked out. Hello? Hello?